Hello, HTV boxing fans. Ganesh Afre Lamte just finished his bout in Tanzania against Abraham Daldapo. And as always, we bring you our immediate post fight reaction. So, round one started with Afre being on the offensive, very aggressive with his left jabs and occasionally with a powerful left hook. Abraham appeared to be looking for body shots, but Afre always counted with a jab or hook. Toward the end of the round, um, it appeared Lamte wanted to finish Abraham just round one when he cornered him and gave him a very good beat. Abraham, on his part, escaped and started throwing some wild punches towards the end of the, of the round. Wow, Alfred, he didn't come to play. And this is end of round one. Wow. I was very impressed. Lamte started uh, round two started with Abraham being more aggressive with multiple left hooks and body shots. But Lamte with his own uh, more counted with his uh, more uh, powerful counter punches. Round two was one of the best rounds with powerful exchanges between both boxes. The boxes slapped it out throughout the whole of round two. Really, I think Alfred is ready. Mm. So mid round, mm. They really were exchanging in here. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Afra kept the jabs out. Ooh. This was a really good fight. Round 3 started with both boxes being very cautious, but it wasn't long before they got aggressive again. Lamte kept his um, left jab up whenever they both were not being aggressive. The boxes were very active. This is mid round three. Mm. Jabs. Jabs. Mm -hmm. Round four continued where the boxes left off. Um, Lamte had the upper hand as she was connecting lots of his punches. About 30 seconds into the round, Abraham gave um, Lamte a low blow which stunned Lamte a bit. They continued through the round but by my estimates, Lamte had landed more um, some punches than Abraham. This is when he, he gave him the low blow. Um, you can tell from our first face that he's hurting. And he came back stronger. Round 5 was very interesting. It started out normal with good exchanges uh, fighters, but midway Lamte switched to South Paul. It was obvious Abraham was not expecting it. Lamte took over um, the round and towards the end of the round. In fact, it appeared Abraham was just a punching bag. Lamte destroyed him and I think the bell actually saved him. You see that? Abraham got some power too. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is a round five. Afro was killing him. The bell saved him. In round six, Lamte was more composed with his shots, very calculated. Abraham, on the other hand, 
was throwing wild um, punches everywhere and every now and then he would connect because he was the more aggressive one he kept Lamte on the defense but towards the end of the round Lamte unleashed on him again mm. <clears throat> Gustavo Pina Atari. Alfred wasn't letting him breathe at all. Mm. 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 He could have finished him in round six. But round <laughs> seven started with Lamte in control with his jabs. Throughout the whole round, he would control and occasionally throw in some big and powerful combinations. About two minutes into the fight, he caught Abraham uh, with the devastating left hook. I must say that despite the punishment Abraham was uh, receiving, he was unperturbed by Lamte's punches. He just kept on going. Mm. I really love Afresh combinations. Jam, jam. 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 Mm. <laughs> mm. Abraham is durable. I'm giving it to um, Afres. The last round started with fireworks. Both fighters didn't want to leave any room for possible knockout. Lamte um, honored Abraham early on and gave him some serious lessons. And he took over the whole of round 8 till the end. I think that um, this was a good, a good um, fight for um, Afred Lamte because Abraham in that Dapo is not a pushover. Yeah, he's more of a veteran, but he has some accolades under him and he's very experienced. He needed um, Lamte needed this fight. He needed this fight. I have seen um, Lamte fight in Ghana, and I must say that I saw a lot of improvements here. Uh, I'm, I'm very glad that his handlers took him there to fight an experienced boxer I, I could see the the, um, the the killer instinct in his eyes anytime he cornered or he caught um, in that dapo of dark so this is overall good and I think he should just keep going um, he's one of the um, the big stars Ghana has in the making all right this thanks for watching with us HTV boxing fans this is what we do boxing all day i'm your host the boxing doc